Barber in custody after fatal stabbing a vendor during dispute. A dispute between a barber and a vendor in Ocherius in St. Anne on Tuesday resulted in one of the men being stabbed to death and the other taken into police custody. The deceased has been identified as 21-year-old Darnell Baxter, a vendor of Arsetown in the parish. Reports on the police are that about 10 a.m. Baxter went to a barber shop in close proximity to where he sold his items from a cart. An argument reportedly developed between him and a barber at the shop during which Baxter was stabbed. He was assisted to a hospital where he died. His alleged attacker is to be questioned by the police as investigation continue into the incident. The Central Kingston police are processing the scene of a murder. Our new centre is informed that a male has been shot and killed on Free Street in the parade called the community known as Southside. The person is unidentified, but police sources have told our new centre that he succumbed to his injuries. The community has been plagued with warring gangs in recent weeks. The genocide and the dark side gangs are engaging in a bloody turf war that has claimed more than a dozen lives. The police have not yet determined a motive for this killing. Our new centre has also received an order recording of what sources say they believe is the motive for the shooting. More details to come soon. Firearm sees several persons detained in toil operation. The police have so far seized a firearm and detained a number of persons for questioning in a major operation by the security force along Yaka Avenue in Toil in St. Angel on Wednesday. According to police sources, the seized firearm is a Ruga 9mm pistol. Several rounds of ammunition was also seized. The operation is aimed at disrupting criminal activities in the St. Andrew South Police Division. Lawyers say Buju Data Abby Ail Myri is not missing. The attorney at law for Abby Ail Myri, the 21 year old daughter of veteran dancer Lattis, Mark Buju Bantan Myri, is assuring the public that she is not missing as is being reported in the media and by the communication arm. Of the police. In a statement to the media, Macari decided to assure the public that Miss Mary is safe. He added that Mary is concerned about the report and would like to assure the public of her well being. She is in direct communication with her mother. The police has been advised for the same. In a press release earlier today, the corporate communication unit of the JCF noted that Mary has not been seen are heard from since Saturday, October 9. The report said that Abiel was last seen at her home. McCarthy told Star that he would be released in another statement at 8.30 on Wednesday morning. More details to come.